Hey guys, it's Lady Ghost here, and I'm bringing you guys a basic tutorial for vanilla servers or single player if you want. And I'm going to show you guys how to make a warp, custom warp. I'm um, sorry I didn't finish building that, by the way. Uh, it's a custom warp. Um, just put in the coordinates, and it'll teleport you. See? Came out up here. Go back down. Go through it, and I'll get teleported up to the top. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to build this. Um, let's get rid of the water. Okay. Getting rid of the water. Now, I'm not going to go in here because I'll teleport away. Basically, you're going to go to build. You're going to want to build your design. However you want. I just use quartz if you want to use, like, a nether portal type shape uh, you can go ahead but don't light it because <laughs> you my friend will teleport to the nether now let's see here so you can use any kind of uh, base you want fill it in some more for looks I mean if you really want you can leave an empty watch It'll still teleport but for looks, I put in water. Like this. I think it just makes it look nicer. Okay. Now I'm going to show you guys how to build this. Okay. Here is the device. Now I'm going to break this so I don't teleport away. Now, you're going to come through here. And you're going to see this set up. Let's close this all back up. This is the command block we're using. It's one command. TP at P. Which means teleport the nearest player. And then in brackets, R equals 2. That means a radius of 2 blocks. Now you want to keep it at a radius 2 blocks. This right here is where the water is. This is where you walk and you're teleported. Now if you had it at three blocks, then you'd teleport from here, four blocks from here, five blocks from here. So the best thing to do is get it as close to the teleporter as you can. That way you don't have the problem of getting too close and teleporting away. You might also want to block off this area in a two block radius like this. Make it look however you want. That way if they that way if anybody gets access to like over here in this area they won't be teleported by getting too close because they won't be able to get too close and then after you have this you won't teleport right away because you have to make a redstone clock I can show you guys how to do that you're gonna need a redstone comparator uh, oops some redstone and a redstone torch you're gonna build one here one here, so that's two. One here, one here. Uh, like a lightning bolt. <laughs> and then I sit down the comparator. You're gonna right click it, down your torch, and well, now it's on. If you get anywhere close to it, or into teleporting. Yeah. Guess I messed it up somehow. <laughs> Oops. Now if you get anywhere close to it, you're going to teleport. And I just fell through the ground because, um, yeah. Okay. So now you go through your portal, land here, and you'll teleport. Now another thing you can do, so you, uh, if you want to be able to get close to it, I mean you can right click it from a distance, but if you don't want to accidentally teleport yourself, you can do R equals 2, and then M equals 1. I think, oh wait, M equals 2. Game mode. Yeah, that's what I thought. Or game mode equals 0, because 2 is adventure mode, I think. Let me check. Yeah, game mode 0, and it'll teleport. But, you go into game mode. One, if you go down, you shouldn't teleport. 
so you don't teleport because you're in creative mode. So M stands for the mode that the closest player is in, and it'll only teleport you if you're in survival mode. And if your map's in an adventure mode, adventure map, an adventure mode, it changes to two. You change it to one. Well, that's for creative, and we'll teleport. So yeah, that's how you make a warp. You can really do anything you want with it. Um, so yeah. There you guys go, it's my tutorial. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. And like, subscribe, leave a comment, leave suggestions. Um, if you guys want a certain tutorial on something, just let me know. And then I've been thinking about starting a, a series of simple facts about, like, simple tutorials on command blocks and what all the commands do. So, yeah, um, Hope you guys enjoyed and everything. And well, bye!